guys, welcome back to another episode here in Chilled and Yummy. And now, I'm gonna help you to prepare a mango salsa. So are you ready? <laughs> so now, let's go and prepare it. So hi guys, so here is the mise en place. So mise en place is a French term uh, relating to putting everything in place. So as you can see here, I put it everything in place. So here is the chopping board. Here is the chef's knife. Um, here is um, the bowl that we will put where um, we cut the thing. So for example, if we cut the mangoes, we'll put the mangoes there. If we cut the um, red onions, we're gonna put the red onions there. And here is a trash bowl. So what's the purpose of a trash bowl? Basically, um, it explains in itself. So a trash bowl is where you put for example, um, the peels of the mango or like um, the trash from the um, red onions. If we're gonna dice the mango, so there are, there are many ways. Some um, peel off first the, the, the peel of the mango and then they cut it in, and dice it, basically. But um, here is a technique wherein you just um, gonna, like, gonna pinch. So for example, here, you're just gonna hold the knife there and then you're gonna pinch it. Okay, you're gonna pinch. Okay, then cut. Okay, and then now you're, what you're gonna do is like um, cut it, but not um, through the through the peel. So we're just gonna um, cut it like dices. So we're gonna cut it horizontally and also vertically. So the reason why um, you want to cut it like this is that if you try to um, like bend or like stretch your mango, you're just gonna ha gonna have some slices like that, okay? And now you're just gonna cut it. And now, you have some diced mangoes. Um, you're just gonna wipe, for example, the, the chopping board and then your knife. So it means that um, you're resetting for another, or that you're preparing for the next ingredient to cut. So now we're gonna we're gonna cut the red onions. So we're gonna dice the red onions, and then we're gonna put it in the same bowl. Okay, the the root of the onion is still there, so um, it holds the onion or the half of the onion. So it it will be intact. So we're just gonna put incisions. So we're gonna put um, like horizontal incisions. Okay, so this um, this part. Make sure that you're gonna have a perfect dice. You're gonna do some cut, so you're gonna adjust so everyone can see. You're gonna cut it like that. Okay. After doing so, um, now you're gonna cut it. Okay. Make sure that you're doing the 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 cat's claw. So basically, the knuckle will push you. Okay. Using this will push you, will guide you. So, um, hand it like a baseball bat, or like a baseball, baseball, not a bat. So holding it, and then adjusting your finger in the process, okay? And then you gotta lay down. And then basically this will be all left, okay? The root. You just, you just, you just base it on how can you tolerate the heat, or how well do you want the, um, the salsa to be like um, spicy? Okay, the spicy level with the salsa. So you're gonna get a spoon. Okay, I'm gonna get a spoon. So I'm getting a spoon. Now you see the water. You're just gonna try to fish out these jalapenos one by one. An ample amount to support the, the number of my mangoes. For this recipe, I'm using a pickled jalapeno pepper. Okay, it's already sliced, but you can buy um, fresh jalapenos on your local markets or your local grocery stores. Okay, so, but now we're gonna use this um, type of jalapeno because is it, is, it is really difficult to find a jalapeno, especially um, this situation right now, right? So, so by means saying you're just gonna do a rocking boat motion, okay? So I'm doing this technique because I want to have the bits of jalapenos and not big ones, so it can complement. Um, it can greatly complement the dish. You can do it by speed, like not really speed, but you're just gonna make sure that you are mincing, okay? 
the reason that, that I'm not dicing it because I want it to be tidbit. So basically, it's in, it's on your own um, prescription or like um, of your own taste. So for me, that is okay. Having that kind of um, um, cut on jalapenos, I'm just gonna add it here. Okay. Um, here, so my my uh, wall of spices. This is the basil, okay? Open it. So we're just gonna put like baby mango salsa. So we're just gonna squeeze it. So if if that's not enough, we're just gonna continue like cutting, then squeezing. Um, it's good that um doesn't have seeds on that part. Okay, if you think that that is enough, you can see it in the bottom, the lemon. You, you can now add some olive oil to top it up. And then we're gonna put some um, olive oil. So now I'm looking at the salsa and I think that it lacks more of the, the basil. So we're gonna put a little more, okay? And now we're gonna put a little bit of pepper. So make sure to um, to taste it after, okay? If you need it more. So but a coarse pepper is okay. Okay, a little bit of pepper. And a pinch of salt, okay? Here is our um, mango lemon salsa. Um, now, we're good. after you have done this um, salsa, you're gonna put this in the in the refrigerator to let it chill, let it um, let it set. Approximately 10 hours later. So if you like this video, comment, like, subscribe na. So comment down what you liked in the video or maybe what you don't like in the video. So pwede mo guys yan. So comment down below lang. So pwede kayo mag-comment sa mga shoutouts for our next videos and such. And maybe share na rin sa mga social media. So I also have some social media accounts. So at Facebook, Marker Nation TV. So meron ako mga streams dyan ng mga games and yung mga Marky Bits or other Marky Bits ko na ipipost ko nito sa YouTube. Also, I also have a Twitter account at MarkerNTN, Instagram at MobShots. So, I also have TikTok and Steam. So, makikita nyo yung links na yan on the description down below. So, make sure that you subscribe, guys, to be updated for my next video. So, yun, guys. If you have suggestions sa aking, ano, kung gusto nyo i-content ko, then pag may collabs or important um, business about or like promotions or um, sponsors or collabs, um, my email is on the description down below, so you can also check that. So, yun guys, um, I hope that you like this video, guys. I have also other videos, come check that out. Marker Nation, Kumo Y. Bye, guys. See you in the next video. Bye. Time card.